everyone. Today we have a kettlebell workout for you and we've got glute and shoulder focus. I'll be going through it one round. Um, feel free to repeat this two more times for a great full body workout. Remember to keep your abs tucked in as we go through each move and focus on each um, exercise that we're doing. Okay? Hey guys. All right. We got six moves here starting with that overhead kettlebell swing. We really want to lock out at the top of our shoulders. Uh, make sure we're sending those glutes back first, not bending those knees first because we're going to put too much stress there. Um, again, that hip action is going to send that kettlebell up overhead. Shouldn't be too much arm movement there. All right, next move we got here, guys, is that lateral walk. Again, you're going from side to side. You want the kettlebell to be going towards the um, direction that you're going. Keep your chest up high in the air. As you can see, I'm adjusting during that. Make sure your shoulders rolled back and you're squeezing your glutes at the top. And stop. All right, guys, next we have that double kettlebell swing. We're going to start low and then get it up to that shoulder height, just like a regular Russian kettlebell swing. Again, we really want to focus on the movement first, so find a pace that you can stick with and still do it correctly. Again, we're sending our hips back first to drive that down and then up again. Stop. All right, guys, here we got the high pull. So we're going to be in that deadlift position, getting that flat back, driving through the glutes and hamstrings to pull that up to our shoulder height. Again, this shouldn't be too much on our shoulders, but we really want to feel it in our hamstrings and glutes. As you can see, I'm getting that flat back, feeling the pull in the back of my leg, um, kind of on the opposite side of my knee. So that's where you need to be feeling it. Let me know if you have any questions on that one. All right, here we got the um, one arm thruster. We're focusing on one side, kind of loading on one side, then moving to the other. Here's the first five on the right side. Here we're honestly in that squat position, feet just outside our hips, driving our knees out, pressing that weight forward, feeling it a little bit more in our shoulders, but also that progression with our glutes. All right, next up here, our last one is the goblet squat. Big thing, um, big difference between a regular squat and goblet squat is it's a narrow stance. My knees are still driving out towards my toes and my elbows can be tucked inside my knees. Again, keep that chest nice and proud um, and upright. You want to see any lettering on your shirt. Um, that's a great indicator as well. Head is neutral um, and not tilted forward at all either. Posture is everything, guys, so just make sure your shoulders are rolled back in this entire sequence and your abs are pulled in to effectively do this movement. All right, guys, that's all that I have for you today. Again, that was six exercises. If you have any questions about the movement focus, please let us know. Um, however, enjoy, and yeah, have a great day.